This familiarization video has been developed to help trained operators of powered access equipment understand the general safety and operating features of this machine. Whilst every effort has been made to ensure that the information provided is accurate and up-to-date, Nationwide Platforms accepts no liability for reliance on the contents of this video, which has been produced for guidance only. It is not intended to replace the manufacturer's manual. This machine is an iPath Category 3B MUP. If you do not hold this category license, then you should consult your employer. Operator Responsibilities Before using the machine, please ensure that the machine has an up-to-date thorough examination. It is a mandatory requirement that a pre-use check is completed. This should include a full function check of all controls, including the emergency lowering control. Please refer to the machine warning decals and operator's manual before use. Ground Controls The key switch and boom functions, including the emergency stop and auxiliary system, can be operated from the ground control panel. Visual and audible warnings are activated when the relevant boom functions are operated. Platform controls To operate the machine from the platform, the ground key switch needs to be in the platform position. On entering the platform, remember this is an iPath Category 3B MUP, therefore ensure you attach to the lanyard anchor cable. Pull out the emergency stop. Activate and hold the heater plug switch for approximately 7 seconds. Release and then hold the starter switch until the engine starts. To activate the boom functions, press and hold the enable button on top of the controller and move in the desired direction as indicated by the decal. Drive controls. Depending on the position of the control box and orientation of the platform, the machine may move in unexpected directions when the drive and steer functions are activated. The color shape coded arrows on the joystick decal correspond to similar arrow decals on the machine chassis. Be sure to check the arrows on the chassis before using the drive steer functions. Steering The machine has three modes of steering. Front wheel steer. Crab steer. And all wheel steer. Use the steer mode switch to select your option. Out riggers. The machine is fitted with out riggers. These are for levelling and stabilising the machine. Before deploying or retracting the outriggers, visually check that the area around each outrigger is clear of personnel and material. Once the outriggers are fully deployed, the full range of boom functions are enabled. The Titan is fitted with self-levelling and should only be activated using the function buttons on the platform controller. A green light will indicate when the outriggers have been fully deployed. The Outrigger Deploy Retract switch operates the Outrigger arms at both the front and rear of the machine. Without the Outriggers deployed, the machine has a restricted working envelope and its working height is reduced. It can still be driven at reduced height with care. Platform Material Loading The Titan is equipped with two loading gates for the assisted loading of heavy materials. Ensure to attach to the lanyard anchor cable before fully opening the loading gates during loading operations. To load palletized or other large material, remove the single spring pin that holds the loading gate in the closed position. Fully open the loading gate. Load material onto the platform, taking care to keep the load in the designated load zone marked on the platform floor. Close the loading gate and secure it with the spring pin. 
Secure the load with straps tied to the tied down points before moving the machine. Refer to the safe working load decal or operator's manual for this information. Overload warning. This machine is fitted with an overload protection device that will sound an alarm and cut out the functions if the platform weight limit is exceeded. How the overload system affects the machine's functions depends on the serial number and year of manufacture. Refer to the safe working load decal or operator's manual for this information. Tilt alarm. The machine is fitted with an alarm which will sound only when the machine is on a slope. Do not depend on the tilt alarm as a level indicator. If the tilt alarm sounds when the platform is raised, lower the platform immediately. Move the machine to a firm, level surface. Emergency lowering. If the control system fails while the platform is elevated, use the emergency lowering procedure to safely lower the platform. Push and hold the auxiliary power switch, then use the relevant boom extend retract function to lower the platform into a stowed position. In the unlikely event that the operator is incapacitated or the engine fails to start, the machine can be recovered using the ground controls. To lower the platform, Turn the key to the ground position and ensure the emergency stop is in the out position. Press and hold the auxiliary ground control switch whilst operating the relevant boom functions. Nationwide Platforms has produced emergency lowering plans for this make and model of machine. These plans can be viewed and downloaded from nationwideplatforms.co.uk or scan the QR code on the machine. Emergency recovery should be practiced using these plans or by using the information found in the operator's manual. Securing the machine. At the end of use, return the turntable to the normal drive position, retract and fully stow the boom. Park the machine in a secure designated location and switch the ground control key switch to the off position and remove the key. Finally, ensure the emergency stop is pushed in. Lifting and point loading. For machine unladen weight, point loading and use of designated lifting points, refer to the manufacturer's information plate or operator's manual. Alternatively, contact Nationwide Platforms. For technical support, please contact 0845 745 0000 and select option 2. Please ensure you have your machine serial number and e-code to hand when calling. These can be found on the Nationwide Platform's data plate which is fitted to your machine. For iPath training, please select option 1 or book online at nationwideplatforms.co.uk forward slash training. <laughs> <laughs>